Welcome back, everybody. Time now for tonight's hometown hero, Rudy Garcia Tolson. The Riverside native is a four-time Paralympian and two-time gold medalist, and now is coming out of retirement to chase another gold. Here's Lisa Hillary with his inspirational story. SoCal native, Paralympian Rudy Garcia Tolson was born with a series of congenital defects. By the time he was five years old and 15 surgeries in, he told his parents he'd prefer to have both legs amputated. Rudy was a fighter, a competitor. At eight years old, he joined a swim team, racing against kids who had all their limbs. And each time, Rudy finished last. You're finishing last every time. And most kids at that age would quit, yet you didn't. For a young kid doing a race, being last is a fear that I think almost all kids have. My first goal was actually to beat a kid with legs. That's all I wanted to do. Um, and I was tired of being known as the boy with no legs. Just knowing that he had the will inside of him, it made me strong to keep pushing him and telling him that you can do it. Just that little bit of motivation that pushed me each race to not be last is really what got me to the world stage. Rudy was resilient. At age nine, he set the Olympics as a goal. And by the time he was 16, he won his first gold medal. To me, it was an experience like I, I never, ever expected. You know, being able to hear my name being called, being able to walk on top of the podium with a gold medal around my neck and hearing the national anthem playing, that point was a defining moment for me. 15 years later, now 31, this four-time retired Paralympian is back on the road and in the pool training for another shot at a medal. You've accomplished so much, Rudy. What made you decide to come out of retirement? What made me do it was, uh, you know, simple. I missed it. I, I missed competing. With that whole extra year to train because of the Paralympics and Olympics being postponed until 2021, that really gave me the green light. Rudy is truly an inspiration and a role model for kids with physical disabilities. And he sends a consistent message reminding them that they too can have their Rudy moment a real disability is a negative attitude. My message to, to the kids who are who don't fit in is that, that that's an awesome thing. You know, there's no one out there who can do you better than you. If you feel like you don't fit in or you feel that you're different and the kids stare at you, you know, don't let that get to you because being different is one of the coolest things that you could possibly do in this world. There will always be people who will tell you that you cannot do something and I want them to realize that they can do whatever they want, regardless of their ability. For Sports Central, I'm Lisa Hillary. Great story there, Lisa. Uh, Rudy's currently working as a coach for the New York Roadrunners. You could learn more about them at nyrr.org.